Hello everyone! As you might have guessed, I'm playing Crash Landing Hardcore Map and today I want to show you how you can automatically refill your empty camel pack like this. So let's get started. So I moved to my basement and now I'm actually gonna tell you what you're gonna need to rebuild the whole system. Everything you need is in this chest, so let's take a look. First you're gonna need some pressure plate, which you're gonna step on. Then you're gonna need some chest for external storage. Then four glass bottles, machine inventory manager, inventory cables, just two of them, advanced inventory relay, which can interact with your inventory, redstone receiver, which will receive from the pressure plate, autonomous activator and some water storage. It can be drum or some kind of tank. And now let's actually build the whole system. So you're gonna need redstone receiver then advanced inventory relay on top of it with pressure plate. Then you're gonna place your machine inventory manager with some cabling on top so it can access the inventory relay. Also block of cable here, autonomous activator right there. Chest down here so it can also access it through this cable and water on top of the chest so the autonomous activator can access it by right clicking. And now let's get to the programming. The program itself consists of uh, two main parts. Now we're gonna make the first which will be refilling the empty bottles with water. So we're gonna start with trigger. It will take every one second. Then you wanna place flow control. But you wanna split the output. Then we wanna input from the chest and uh, we want to output just empty bottles uh, and we want to output them to the autonomous activator I will set up it so that uh, it will input from down and it will output to the bottom. So now we wanna create input and we gonna input from the autonomous activator actually not down but uh, you as you can see it's north so we wanna input from the north and we wanna output just bottles full of water so like this and we want to output these bottles to the chest. So, any side activate blacklist like this. And now, if we actually place our four bottles, they will be output to the autonomous activator. And when I place the water drum 
it will draw the water and transfer the water bottles into this chest. So this is the first part. Now the second part will be a little bit tricky. We will create a new trigger and this trigger will actually work just when the pressure is pressed. So we want to activate the redstone receiver which uh, we placed down there and it will emit when it receives a redstone signal and when it receives redstone signal we can say on high pulse do something now what we want to do we want to input from the advanced inventory relay from the slot 38 which is actually your chest slot now I should make a real quick visit to my system huh. uh, it will input the camel pack but we want to input it only when it's got the damage value of 100 which is when your camel pack is uh, totally empty now we want to output this camel pack to um, yeah activate uh, we want to output it to the chest it doesn't matter where now we've got water bottles and the camel pack in the chest so we just want to check if we've got everything we need we will check if in the chest we've got camel pack you've got one camel pack with damage value 100 then we want to check if we've got four water bottles I didn't connect this. Now, if we don't have these things, for example, when the when not all of the bottles are filled with water, we want uh, the camel pack to go back to our chest so we want to select advanced inventory relay uh, no we want to select chest where the camel pack actually is right now we want to whitelist camel pack um, and we want to output the camel pack to our chest so we select advanced inventory relay slot number 38 activate blacklist now if the condition is true then it means we can craft 
the full camel pack and we can do it like this we will input everything from the chest again doesn't matter which side you decide to pull out of uh, blacklist we want to export everything now we have it in uh, our buffer so we can create auto crafter and the recipe is something like this we wanna precise detection damage value 100 access inventories we wanna select the chest and now we have everything crafted we can output to our inventory to the chest slot which is again 38 whitelist camel pack amount 1 damage value 0 that means that we have full camel pack Now one more thing you need to set up before this uh, system can work. You want to right click on advanced inventory relay and you want to give permission to yourself. That means this block can now interact with your inventory. And that should be all you need to do. So let's go try it. I will switch my camel pack and here we go thanks for watching see you next time